money making Mitch. Tell me something good, babe. It's all good, Ice. I know it is. I ain't gonna lie, that's one tough truck right there. That just woo. parking's gotta be crazy. But anyway, fresh pop church. Yeah, you already know. You're gonna hang with me today, right? Do we have a choice? Yeah, let me catch all up to speed, man. Yesterday was Saturday. I do nothing but clean, man. I'm trying to. I'm trying to get a tidy household. You know, you gotta take care of home first. And I learned that. I'm trying to get my household together, nice and clutter-free, so I can be. What's the word? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> shout out to the Bodak. <laughs> but no, seriously. Oh uh, yeah. No, I feel that with a, a clean household and don't get it misconstrued with like, I got dishes and all this. No, no, no. I just got a lot of clutter. I got to go through a lot of things. Matter of fact, there's another thing that I, I was um, contemplating. I think I'm going to start selling like some, selling like some of my gear that I ain't rocking because I be getting more stuff in, especially with my sponsors and stuff. I was looking one day, especially shout out to um, Effectus Clothing. See that joint right there? Bro, I looked at that joint. I was counting them how many shirts they had on their they homepage. Bro, I got every single shirt. Oh, check you out. And no room, but I'm gonna have to fix that. But anyway, y'all already know my favorite view. So anyway, let me let y'all know what this video is gonna be about. Just wait, wait, well, hold up. YouTube, what's good? It's your boy, Wavy. You already know this is my channel, Mr. Orchard Beach. If you're new to the channel, you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, hit that subscribe button, like, comment, all the above. Today's vid, what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna be discussing three sneakers off the top of my head that I know have broke my heart. And when I mean broke my heart, it means that they have eluded me. And I, I, I still have this passion that I that I hold for them, you know? Or, oh, another spot we're gonna go to. Last week, I took y'all to the Cool Herc mural. We're about to go to the birthplace of hip hop. And last but not least, my Cowboys are playing the Watch the Redskins. Hate the Redskins, but shout out to DC. Y'all gonna just fly. So, you know what I'm saying? But I don't like the Redskins. But anyway, let me put this joint down because this ain't the kind of place to be recording. <laughs> hey, you say one word, then here they come with the word. Trying to flip it and bounce it and shit on some yeah. bullshit. Yeah. Not sounding right, first of all. That was crazy. So yeah, I had to throw on another T underneath, man. It's kind of nippy out here. Probably tonight I'm gonna have to break out the damn tech. Ugh, gotta get some gas. But anyway, yo. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this little trip right quick over to the further west side of the bronx check out the building that hip-hop first started at now i gotta do some more things but man y'all coming along with me so follow me follow me follow me out so you think that hip-hop had its start out in queensbridge if you pop that junk up in the bronx you might not live because you're in south bronx the south south bronx the south bronx the south south bronx go yo cedric aka hip-hop boulevard this is where it all went down and as you see by the by the sign, they didn't change it from all. Uh, it's Cedric Ave, but it's Hip Hop Boulevard too. Or that was big right there. Yeah, this is where it's where they said it all started. I have one correction to make. Um, or well, two. Yes. Uh, I said, oh, it reminds me of Crush Grooving that that building, but no, I meant to say Beat Street. And also, Cool Herc was not born in the Bronx, but Cool Herc is the Bronx. So I ain't want nobody. Nah, he was born in Jamaica. Uh, it's cool. You know, I, I know what I mean. Word. <laughs> Definitely cold out today. I couldn't be dressed like this if I was out, out. No, I don't know. But yo, so first sneak that broke my heart. And I'm talking on some recent shit. The Jordan 6 Gatorade joints, those green ones. Man, I don't know what the fuck oh, oh, I know what happened. I think I was in Carolina and I don't know, I just couldn't get it. Somehow, I, I just, I don't know. I wasn't thinking I should have had somebody like try to reserve it for me there. But anyway, yeah, I didn't get those. Put a bad taste in my mouth, pause. But I think over the months, I kind of got over, <laughs> kind of got over that sneak, you know? It was kind of like, all right, I'll get you. Definitely. I would have loved to rock them joints with some, uh, some canes, some canes gear. Especially that, that old school uh, Hurricanes joint that Luke used to rock. Sheet. Hell yeah, I'd have been ready. But yeah, them joints, them joints got away. But shout out to Rishi Rish. Welcome back to, um, he tried getting them for me. As a matter of fact, something happened with um, the postal service, U U UPS. Cause I remember uh, he even had a recording and shit. 
it. So, yo, salute to you for that. But, yeah, I just couldn't, couldn't get them joints, man. Still want them. That hurt. That, that kind of, that was my first, that was my first pain right there. Hello. I'm the modern day Robin Hood, show me a spot I'll set up a clock in five minutes My niggas craps looking like Popeye on spinach Out a video chick, how much you charge honey? She said five bills, that shit Better come and sucky, sucky, it's nice uh, Eat what I want, drink what I want For a dollar In and out of there just like a robbery Shout out to homie at the counter I had the wrong coupon, I was like, yeah, let me get that Cold coffee, you're like, you mean cold brew? I don't want no tea <laughs> He said, I got you though, don't worry. That's what it's about. Y'all ever remember cats that were like job scared? Like you ask them, you'd be like, yo, yo, who me up with some fries? And they'd be like, oh no, man, I can't, I can't do that. And uh, get the fuck out of here, you can't. That same batch will get old, and but you can't throw it away. Like, get out of here. Uh-uh. Damn, gotta go get my Bama fit. Oh, uh, in and out of here, just like a robber. I was in my closet and I couldn't find a suit. I was like, damn. Came down here to see if I dropped it off. They said, hell yeah, I like though. All right. So the Bama Fit is recovered and accounted for. Is recovered and accounted for. We're good. New York issue number 2073. Ugh. When you can't find close parking, you got a lot to haul. Cell phones is blowing. The crew's not available. Ask double word in the town. We the realest do. We don't need no diamond rings. All we need is a drum. Like, fuck it. He can rhyme. I say. So. Next pair that really uh, had me feel a certain way was the MX-98, the Gundam joints. Man, I thought that they was gonna be kinda hard due to the fact those 97s kinda took me for a little loop. But I ain't know I wasn't just gonna get them and the price was gonna be that damn crazy, man. It was, boy, I already knew what I was gonna rock with it, when I was gonna rock them. It didn't happen, but the good thing was the shit that I got to rock with it, it didn't go no way, so it went for me. Ugh, wavy. Yeah, wavy. Girl, you're every woman in the world to me. You're my fantasy. You're my reality. Girl, you're every woman in the world to me. Alright, so let's see what's popping in this damn draft house. It used to be a nice sports bar. It still could be, but they took the sports away. All right, so I'm outside watching this Cowboys game. We're tied up right now. You see Yankee Stadium right here? I hope you do. <laughs> but anyway, yo, so my third and final heartbreak would have to be the, the last release. The Jordan 1 Pines, man. I remember I got hit up by gorgeous by Amy at Eblins. She was like, yo, we got the, we got the purple joints, the court, court purple, you can come check them out. So I was ready to do that. You know, I was hyped. I was like, all right, cool. Cause I already got my I already got my foot locker uh bid in, so I'm good in the raffle, I thought. Man. So the whole time I'm reviewing these little court purple joints, I'm losing out on them damn pine green. So Thursday came, I didn't get the pine green. I said damn. But I figured I was like, all right, ain't no thing. I'm gonna be able to get them even if I don't do the uh, the foot locker joint, you know? Nope, <laughs> damn sure didn't. All right, they go that rude ass poor train. But yeah, nah, damn sure didn't. I said, damn, and I was hurt on that because I was already ready, you know what I'm saying? Me and them pines, yo, we could have bridged together. <laughs> we could have damn sure bridged together, for real. Them pines could have been on my last vid, worse. But anyway, so I ain't get them. I guess I had a second chance to get them. Somebody hit me up and they was like, oh, I can get these for you, boom, boom. I got you. I said, all right, cool. You know what I'm saying? I'm with it. Damn sure with it. Haven't heard anything back yet. So, you know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. But I didn't say anything about it because kind of chickens for the hatchet get you caught in the oh, like Pimp C said. Word. Or he said it some way. He said it like this. Count chickens that this egg to get you caught in the book. Make it fall accusations fake. Yeah, no. Nah. Um, I would have loved to have got them. Man, them just hurt. I still want them joints, man. I still want them. For 200 no more no more ship 
200 yeah. and if i'm in the city 180 i still want them joints man for real them pine ones damn that really got me dang yeah that's my heart <laughs> but no that really got me but anyway man i'm gonna go in here i think halftime is about over with so gotta give me some wings her mad but anyway about to give me some wings I mean, it was cool at first, you know. Just with no rapping, but nothing. But then, like, with hopping walks, the people they started, you know, to talk about things that made sense. I let the fuck. People really share, like, let the fuck out of here. Hey, yo, so mother get about the head. It was y'all fault for chilling with me. You know what I'm saying? So, any complaints? It was y'all fault for chilling with me. Hey, shout out to the way my shout out to everybody that's been rocking with me, everybody that's been commenting, liking on my vids. Yeah, you know, follow me on that snap, follow me on the IG, follow me on the Twitter, the Twitter B. But why you do that? Oh! That snubs. See when I see you. Ow.